Now this is all well and good, but we need a way to change that value via some kind of UI controls so we can have a model that we can change. So let's create some more UI stuff. Let's go over here to the HTML package and expose two more controls we need. The first is some type of input control. And second, we need a button to confirm our choice. Let's go down to the view here. And inside of our dig tag, it's gonna get kind of big here because it's gonna contain text and other things. So let's go make this bigger and we'll put a comma here and we'll put a text, an input, which also takes two things and a button, which takes two things. Let's save it, refresh, and there's our controls right there, they're right below it. And just to make sure that we have some room, let's go ahead and put a blank div tag here with nothing in it, just as a simple spacer. Refresh, there we go, now it's below it. And from this input, it doesn't have anything, but the button, let's put some text in there so we know what type of button this is. Add, so we'll hit save, reload, and you can see add. So I click it and nothing happens, but we at least have a view based on using an input tag and a button that has the text add in it. And that's how you can build a basic UI using just simple, pure functions.